Let's yeah. do this kombucha thing. All right. So kombucha, it's the new rave. Uh, people say it's really, really healthy for you. I picked up something called Health Aid Kombucha, and it says a bubbly probiotic tea. I had no clue there was probiotics in this. Yes, I had heard that. Like, yeah. I just thought it was something for vinegar and helped you eliminate your stuff in your system. No, it's one of the reasons <laughs> like people I, get it is for the probiotic side of it. Yeah, I had no clue. So this says pink lady apple, and it's their little take. It says follow your gut. Uh, incredibly crisp with a hint of cider. Our organic and raw pink lady apple kombucha is truly nature's treat. So we're going to, oh, pardon wow. me. I didn't realize it was going to spew all over my pants. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, oh, wow. Not. It's a little a little bubbly. Yeah. I had, sorry about that. Yeah. <laughs> Clean up table seven. <laughs> yeah. You're going to have to just go with it. We don't have any paper towels yeah, on well, the table. I'm not going to go with it yet. Okay. You got to let it calm down. Yeah. So All right, so where, tell me where you, where'd you get that? I got this at our local grocery store, H-E-B. It's where I shop sometimes. Okay, cool. And when you're not shopping at the farm to market, right? Oh, yeah. Wow, this looks like a beer. Yeah, I know. That's what beer. surprised me about the kombucha was that, that oh. there was bubbly to it. I'm like, how do they get the fizzy in it? Because they don't, do they use carbonated water or do we know? I know. Here you go. Can you grab that? It does, it does look like a beer. Okay, I, let's I might feel guilty about. Oh, I think I stepped in something. <laughs> I don't know that. The smell of it's a little wild. Smell very good to me. It smells a little bit like beer. Can I can I see that? <laughs> so it is beer. It, well, Fine. it's <laughs> it's fermented, it. right? This it's is fermented. a fermented drink. Yeah. Yeah. It's in fact the, the oh, phone no. number to call. <laughs> Wait, is it a beer? <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> the phone number to call is one eight four four ferment. On the 1-800. bottle. Ooh. Healthaid.com and at healthaid, right? Yeah. Um, I was really so excited about this, but now I'm not so excited. Just, I'm going to be honest. Just, just go with it. You'll be okay. Um, so, incre- uh, yeah, incredibly crisp. But I want to take a look at the ingredients. So, it's filtered water, kombucha culture, which is yeast and bacteria cultures, which doesn't necessarily <laughs> sound Mom, good. Mom, can you give me more bacteria? Thanks. So, the organic black tea. So, that's, that's really, really good from what I understand. I'm not sure if that's where the probiotics coming from or not, but... Organic green tea, organic evaporated cane juice, um, which is sugar. I like that. Uh, Cold-pressed organic apple juice. So there is no carbonated water in there. So all of that little fizzy stuff must have come from fermentation from process. Fermentation. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. And so. all the organic stuff is a reason it smells like, you know what, they probably use cow manure to, to fertilize that. Pink lady apple. All right. Well, here a you go. A bubbly probiotic tea. Here's to our Well, here's to drinking and not driving. There we go. <laughs> Wow. Oh, okay. <laughs> I actually kind of enjoy that. Yeah? You know. It tastes a little bit like beer. It kind of does. Yeah, it's not for me. <laughs> it's not. She's so but it's honest, okay. right? You know what? It's okay. It's not for me, and that's okay. But a lot of people like it. So when I was getting ready to drink this, because <laughs> you're so expressive, right? I wasn't sure how you were going to respond, and I was actually being very careful because I didn't want it coming out of my nose yes, if you started. All the way over here. <laughs> yeah, it's not for me. Maybe it's for me. <laughs> Make up your mind, woman. <laughs> I kind of like it. I don't know. Maybe I do. <laughs> <laughs> right? It kind of grows on you a little it kinda bit. It kind of does. Yeah. It's got cultures. It probably is growing on you. <laughs> I don't know what you're growing there, but it doesn't smell very good. <laughs> no, so it did right. So it did not pass the smell test Mm-mm. initially. It smells like welcome to Texas, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> At least West Texas where right. they're doing all the uh, oil digging and all that. But I actually kind of like it. Okay. I do. I've got some uh, that I got out the farm to market. It's in a jug, right? You kind of fill it up yourself. Right. Um, this is what I was like, okay, I, I really want that, but I don't want a five-gallon drum of it. I mean, or that big old glass, like, jug. <laughs> like, you're in a jug, and <laughs> you're going to... You're gonna blow in it later, like right, you get stopped by the cops. Like, what's right. in that? It's like I don't know. I don't have to answer your questions, Ossifer. <laughs> <laughs> if I lay down, will you drop me with your little white chalk? <laughs> that would be funny. That's a uh, who was it? That comedian remember. that did that, did that? Yeah, I don't know, but anyway, I remember him. So good job. <laughs> Is he the one that did the? Do you ever notice? I don't. Is think that so. him? No. no. There's some good comedy out there. Good, good redneck comedy. There is out there. I like that, but it's a Texas thing. Speaking of Texas. Can I have some more of this? Yeah, sure. I actually like it, so I'm going to give them a plug. Oh, man, so they got a lot of head Health on. Aid. So this was at H-E-B you said you got, H-E-B, right? H-E-B, yeah. And right now, I'm just going to tell you, guys, it's $3.69 for that. What is that, 12 ounces? Ooh, that's a little but, high. But H-E-B has it now. Buy one, get one free. Oh, okay. So Do I we know threw one that... out the window when I left. <laughs> 
Did you not get a free one? Or I not? gave it to a homeless guy. Yeah. Did you? Really? Yeah. No, you did. did you? Yes. And did he's going to be like, wow. This, this is not beer. Thanks. He's going to be mad. Hey, the next time that red Cadillac pulls up, do not get what yeah, she's right. giving you. <laughs> yeah, I cleaned out for a week. <laughs> right. <laughs> you know, give him that. And then here's a roll of toilet paper. It's on sale, too. <laughs> so there you go. Yeah. So, all right. That's hilarious. So, yeah, out at the farm to market, I get that jug for seven. I think it was $7. Oh, wow. And that is a quite, quite a bit and, more. Yeah, yeah. And that is what kept intriguing me. I saw it week after week and people just walking out, walking out. They love that stuff. So, I was like, I got to try this. But I didn't want to get that big old gallon because, you know, it would probably go down the sink. I got to tell you, I enjoyed doing this little taste test thing. We, okay. We've never done anything like this no, before. But, but I, we've wanted to. Great so, creativity. Yeah, this is awesome. On that. So, awesome. And I'm going to be sipping on this. Uh, throughout the remainder of our short Which show. Which is better than chlorine. So, yeah, <laughs> it's good. Right. <laughs> Why would you say that it's better than chlorine? <laughs> Actually, it's one of my favorite songs by 21 Pilots. It's called Chlorine. We'll play it one of these days. Okay, all right. We can do music reviews, too. I didn't like that song. So, <laughs> it cleaned me out for a week. Uh, music probably <laughs> not supposed to song. do that. 